back to another video. It's been so long since I've done just like a sit down video. Um, just lately because of quarantine, I've been vlogging a lot. So if you're bored and you need something to watch, all of my videos are available. <laughs> Have yourself a little binge sesh, make some popcorn, watch them, whatever you want to do. But anyways, today's video is going to be my March favorites. It is finally April 1st and March is finally over. However, we're probably all going to be stuck inside our houses for the month of April. So it's also going to feel like another 97th day of April going around. So I'm in a different area. Um, just because of quarantine, both my husband and I, we are working from home and he is still working at the moment. So I'm trying to be as quiet as possible. I'm trying to be away from him. So I'm not in my normal area, but I did want to film this video and get it up for you guys so I can post it on my normal posting day. So if you are interested in seeing what my favorites were in the month of March, then just go ahead and keep on watching. So again, this is my third favorites video, so very new, and I have 10 items. I did find it kind of difficult to find 10 items that I really, really love this month, but I did manage to scrounge up some. Um, not necessarily like I'm just throwing it in here, but it's just like I really had to think about the things that I loved this month. As you know, if you've watched any of my other favorites videos, I only picked 10 that I absolutely love, so these are it. So the first item is going to be the Laneige Lip Mask. Um, my birthday was February 27th and I wanted to get my um, my gift from Sephora and I always feel guilty even though I know that it's like free. I always feel guilty going in there and not buying something but I've been wanting to get this for a while because I am the queen of chapped lips. I have a mat, I have a really bad habit of biting my lips, of biting my nails, everything. So they're always chapped, they're always crusty, and they're disgusting. So I wanted to give this a chance, and it does work really well. I have been using it basically every single night, and really, you don't need a lot. Honestly, just the tiniest, it has a little like spatula kind of thing that you use to get the, um, the mask out, and you just need literally so little so this is gonna last me a while I love it it actually has like a really nice um, like fruity kind of flavor to it so it's kind of appealing so I really like this I put it on at night I wake up in the morning and my lips are super super soft and then I get into a habit throughout the day of biting my lips and then it's just a vicious cycle but when I do wake up in the morning this gives me such beautiful soft lips I love the way my lips look in the morning when I wake up so I definitely suggest this. Um, for this, it was $20, I believe, but just for the amount of product that you get and you don't have to use that much, I think it's 100% worth it. So to go on with um, makeup, I picked up this Hello Halo. Um, it's a blush and uh, highlight duo from Wet n Wild. I believe it was like $5. I needed to get some new foundation at Walmart a couple, like literally like a month ago. And so I turned around and I saw this and I was like, ooh, I want to get that. And this is literally what I've been using every time that I've done my makeup. And it hasn't been that often anymore because there's no point with the quarantine. But this is so, so pretty. Honestly, I'm not wearing it today because I had it set aside for the video. But this is so so pretty it's in the shade after sex glow which is a little scandalous but this is so so pretty I love highlight it is my jam it's one thing that I just buy a ton of same as blushes too you guys this is so 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 pretty it's definitely worth the five dollars so if you do have to go out to the grocery store to pick up any essentials Hop over to the uh, to the makeup section and get this, and you will not be disappointed. It is 100% worth it. So I do have like a lot of beauty kind of favorites. So the next thing, which I also got at Sephora for my birthday gift, is I got the Boom Boom Cream from um, Sol Rio de Janeiro. Wait, Sol Sol de Je Why can't I say it? Sol de Janeiro. This stuff, you guys, it smells so good honestly i don't even care about the benefits it's supposed to tighten your skin and leave it really moisturized oh my god the smell of this is absolutely amazing and i'm talking about the boom boom cream it has like a very mature scent to it 
it does smell like a little Caribbean a little bit, but it's not overpowering. Oh my gosh, it is so good. In one of my most recent vlogs, I put it on after I showered for like the first time in like six days, and my husband just loves the scent of this. Um, this is just a travel size, so I am going to be buying the full size. The full size is $46, so it is on the expensive side, but you guys, the scent is amazing. So the next beauty favorite that I also have is this body scrub that I've had for a little bit of a while. Honestly, I completely forgot about it, even though it's been sitting in my um, shower, but this is just a body scrub that I got from Marshalls for $5.99. I'm pretty sure any body scrub will do, but this one has, um, I don't know, it's a body, beauty spectrum, let your skin glow body scrub. I feel like it has some sort of like floral rose scent, but this is so good. And I just used it um, recently and I've completely re, re fell in love with it. So if you're anything like me, I have like those small little bumps on the back of my arm, but it, it's not like super bad when I was younger, it used to be worse, but there's still like a lot of texture on the back of my arm. And when I use this, it was immediately gone. So I think I'm going to have to start using this more regularly rather than like weekly or something, maybe like every other day, because I feel like this is assisting with, you know, taking care of whatever those little bumps are on the back. When at like seriously, after one time of using it, I didn't even notice them there anymore. So I love this. Um, like I said, I I re really fell in love with it this month. And if you don't regularly use a body scrub, I definitely suggest one. They're so cheap. When the stores open back up, you can get them at Marshalls. This, like this huge tub was only $5.99. So definitely go. Walmart has them. So again, if you have to run out for essentials and you're looking for something to uh, treat yourself with, just pick one up. So the next item that I have to share is super random. So lately I had noticed that like my moods were just like really intense. I used to just get mad and angry about everything. So it started to affect how we communicated and I really didn't want it to negatively affect our marriage. So my friend had suggested this book and it's actually really amazing. So it's called A Couple's Devotional. Basically, it's a weekly devotional and each chapter is like two to three pages. It's super, super small, but you set aside 30 minutes to an hour each week with your spouse. You read the, um, the chapter and everything that it kind it just it's like a, it's like a prompt basically and then there's like a call to action for what you do so one of them like the most recent one was confession anything like so, something so small if you feel like you need to confess this is where you need to confess and from then on you have to forgive it's just it's just like little prompts like that so we really really enjoy it um He's so he's so open to this and I love it because it really does help us bond a little bit more. The book was actually created for couples that are engaged and to be married, but it also works for married couples as well. So I don't know. It gives you more of like topics of conversation that really need to be had in marriage. And um, I don't know. I, I just love it. it. It gives us more of something to discuss and it gives us quality time throughout the week. So if you're looking for something to do like this with your spouse, I definitely suggest it. Okay, so super, super, super random, but before I started working from home, these, my like my work, they leave out treats and snacks and stuff. And at the front receptionist, they had suckers and I fell in love with these suckers that I went to Walmart during one of our huge grocery trips for this quarantine and I picked up two bags and you guys, I am not mad about it at all. And they are these Jolly Rancher filled pops. These are so freaking good guys, they're so good. So I got a couple right here to show you. I have a candy jar full of them, they're so good. So the only flavors, oh this is cherry. I forgot that they were cherry. So they have cherry, grape, green apple, and watermelon. And they taste just like a Jolly Rancher. And like this one, this one is cherry with a grape juice. So obviously it's kind of like a Tootsie Pop roll. So you get down to the center of it and then it's just like 
a chewy Jolly Rancher. It's so good, guys. If you have a sweet tooth like me, I swear I have the biggest sweet tooth in the entire world. These are so, 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 so good. And I'm sure it's probably been a hot minute since anybody's ever had a Jolly Rancher, but these guys are so good. I love them so much. Okay, so the next thing I have to share with you, it's going to be put on the screen somewhere, and it is actually another YouTuber slash Instagrammer. Her name is Mariah Robinson, and she's from South Carolina. She's a South Carolina blogger, and I love her. I love her so much. She's so relatable. She's... I don't know. She's just like a really down to earth girl. I love her style. It's super casual. Um, I just love, I just love her so much. Um, and that's really all I can say. I just, I'm obsessed with the girl. Um, I follow her on Instagram and every time she's sharing something, I'm just like, Mariah, you have to stop because I can't spend any more money. you like, just take my, just take my paycheck and spend it for me. Cause that's what you're essentially doing. Um, but I love her so, so much. So if you're looking for another smaller YouTuber, um, fashion blogger, somebody that's super down to earth, she also vlogs with her husband, I will link her channel below. I, I love her so much. Actually, the next item is something that she shared on her Instagram and I've been looking for something very similar but I also have a hard time finding something that I really, really like and they are joggers that she shared. I got, she got these, or she shared these from Amazon. And my main concern was the drawstring. I was really nervous because some pants are really, really tight, tightly cinched around the waist. And I don't like that. So I was really concerned about that. So I asked her, I was like, hey, like, are they super tight around the waist or is there like forgiveness? Because a girl is chunky and I don't need any extra like suckage into my stomach because it's just so uncomfortable. And she said, no, they're drawstring. You're going to love them. So I was like, oh my gosh, I cannot wait. So I bought them and they arrived in two days. And these things are amazing. They're so comfortable. I just washed them. Oh, so they smell clean. But you guys, these are amazing. I'll also have like a little picture of the um, Amazon. If you're looking for good joggers, I definitely suggest these. So the next item that I'm going to share with you is actually super random. You guys are going to be like, wow, this girl's a freaking nerd. And I've been obsessed with the USA Today crossword app. I'm not even kidding you. Every morning I get so excited to log in and do this crossword every single day. I feel like my brain isn't as sharp as it used to be, so I feel like as long as I'm doing like brain exercises or I'm just like kind of challenging my brain a little bit more, it's keeping me more on my toes. So I'm really, really enjoying this. Back in high school, in my history class, my teacher always used to get USA Today, like the newspapers, USA Today on Tuesdays and Thursdays, so we could do current events. And every Tuesday and Thursday, I would go into this classroom and I would rip out the puzzle pages because I love USA Today's puzzles. I don't know what it is about them, but I've loved them since high school, and I'm not, I'm not exaggerating. And I started this when I was a sophomore, which was 2000 and. Six, I want to say so I'm old guys but again I don't know I just love the app so if you're looking for something that's kind of fun and I don't know I don't know triggers your brain <laughs> I would definitely suggest that I don't know it's just one of the apps that I like obsessed with right now okay and the last thing I drink them all so I don't have to share them with you and I really need to order some more from Amazon but they are these vanilla cream or vanilla buttercream coffee pods. You guys, these are so good. Connor's actually been stealing me them from his work and because he's no longer working at his office, that's why we're out, so I need to actually order them myself. But you guys, these are amazing. It actually comes in a variety pack of, I think, peppermint, mocha, cinnamon bun, French vanilla, buttercream and then something else. The buttercream is my absolute favorite. It is so good. Again, I have a sweet tooth, so that, that's of course why I love it. And then the cinnamon bun, guys, the only reason why I haven't had the peppermint is because I just had like my share of it a couple months ago. But again, I would absolutely love that too. But if you're looking for a really, really, really good sweet cream or a sweet coffee, this is it. 
All right, guys, and that is everything that I have for my March favorites. I really hope you guys enjoyed. I will try and link as much as I can down below. Again, I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. I would love for you to be a part of our YouTube family. But other than that, I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Oh, 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 oh,